Hey guys, hope you're doing well. Scotty and Tyler here. We are so excited to let you know that we have just arrived at the Ramada Resort in Gillip Island. We're here for a few days and this property is absolutely phenomenal. This place is a two bedroom villa. It's situated in amongst all these kind of gum trees and stuff. So it's absolutely beautiful and it kind of integrates really well in with the, um, the entire property here at Phillip Island. So let's give you a quick run through. Come up the stairs, we have this little outdoor seating area in amongst all the trees looking through hello <laughs> this awesome kitchen so it's all pretty much brand new it smells brand new so and there's a nice little seating area for lounge room Tyler already getting settled in <laughs> beautiful bathroom and then into one of the main rooms <laughs> and exactly the same on this side here. But yeah, that's a quick little run through on the villas here at Ramada Resort, Phillip Island. We are here for a couple of days. Um, we've got a few things we're going to check out. We're heading to the Peninsula Hot Springs over at Mornington Peninsula tomorrow morning. So it'll be a nice early start for that. Uh, then making our way up to the Mornington Peninsula and also into hopefully St Kilda tomorrow. A uh, long way, but uh, we'll be good to kind of check out uh, what St Kilda has to offer. And then back down this way hopefully for sunset and we can catch a few penguins. Um, that's kind of what Phillip Island is renowned for, so we're looking forward to kind of getting stuck into that and seeing all the landscapes and stuff that it's got on offer. Anyway, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Welcome to the Peninsula Hot Springs here in the Mornington Peninsula. Good morning, Tyler. Good morning. <laughs> we have arrived at 7 a.m. on the dot, ready to check out the hot springs here. And I was not prepared for how hot some of these spas were going to be. Like, we thought they were going to be hot, but some of them are actually kind of boiling. Um, so, yeah, be prepared for that. Um, but, yeah, let's show you guys around. They've got plenty of uh, food options here, cafe, restaurant. And there's like two main sections to the springs. There's uh, like the regular bathhouse and they have like an amphitheater section which um, doesn't open till about nine. Uh, so we're gonna head around, take a few shots and yeah, check out some of the pools and we'll show you the other section shortly. chill little spot so if you find that all the people are frustrating you <laughs> and you want a place to kind of chill out this is it which one was your favorite um i reckon cave one yeah the cave one's pretty cool Hey guys, so Tyler and I have just finished up at the Peninsula Hot Springs. Um, it's about an hour and a half drive from Phillip Island and definitely worth checking out. We would highly recommend getting here early so you guys can kind of enjoy it, have it all to yourself. You get a kind of couple of pools to yourself. You don't have to worry about all the crowds. We're heading off now to kind of check out more of the Mornington Peninsula. I'll show you guys around there. Uh, hopefully we can um, head down, see some of the bays, some of the beaches. Uh, that'll be pretty nice. So until then, stay tuned and we'll see you there. Bye.
Hey guys, we made a quick stop at Cape Bulamai and we have made it to the Pinnacles. The <laughs> <laughs> it's called the Pinnacles, as we just found out. Um, nice little coastal track that kind of takes about probably half an hour to walk. Um, just ducking out of the wind at the moment because it's insanely windy. Um, but we'll definitely put this on the list to check out. Hey guys, how you going? Scotty here. It is our last day here in Phillip Island at the moment. Uh, so yesterday afternoon we headed out, we ate some gelato uh, down at the main town in Phillip Island, down at Cowers Bay. Um, it's a pretty little um, kind of fishing village right on the water. I uh, would highly recommend checking that out. It's got plenty of restaurants, cafes and stuff like that. Uh, this morning we got up and woke up to pretty heavy rain. So uh, it was a bit of a bummer. Uh, we had planned to go out to Cape Bulamai actually and check that out. Uh, but unfortunately haven't quite had a chance to do that yet. We're going to head out maybe this afternoon, see if it's any good. Um, hopefully this rain just doesn't stay around so we can see the last of um, what Phillip Island has to offer. Um, but until then, that's the end of this vlog series and we hope to see you guys in the next one. See ya, bye. But I thought we'd try our um, luck with some penguin spotting at a different beach. Hopefully, um, we'll get to see some penguins. I see one. It's just like... <laughs>